it's Minecraft Grand bringing you another video, and I have some sad news. Apparently, um, Everneath is experiencing some server issues, uh, so I can no longer get to my my base there. I can no longer continue the build there. Uh, I've been away on a, a, a long project for work. I've been gone, I don't know, a couple, three months. I come back and I can't get to my base, so I thought what I'd do since I'm in the mood to play Minecraft. I thought what I'd do is go single player and uh, maybe maybe create a new world. Let's see. Oh, see, I played last night. Uh, let's let's do this. Let's create a brand new world uh, so you can watch this. I'm I'm uh, not gonna enable cheats, so this will be a new series. I may rename this, but okay. Game mode will definitely be survival. Uh, generate structures, world type default, allow cheats off, bonus chest, you know, because maybe we should. Uh, now, I don't have anything for a seed, so I'm just going to let it create that. Okay, create new world. Now, while this is setting up, I am using a new texture pack. Uh, apparently, the one I prefer, Chroma Hills, there are several things in that texture pack that are not being rendered correctly. Uh, so I, I switched over to this one, and although it's kind of cartoony, I kind of like it. So we're going to play with this and see where it takes us. Now, I'm not going to make you sit through, you know, finding a location and uh, building a hobbit hole and going and collecting everything we need. Uh, I need some high ground. Do you see high ground? I don't see any high ground. I was hoping to kind of get the lay of the land. Thankfully, it's daytime. Here's a little bit right over here. Let's see what we have. Oh, oh, missed that one. Missed that one. Oh, this is not too bad. You know, and I kind of like the nearness of water. I tell you what, let's let's go over here. Uh, again, I'm just gonna take you along just long enough to settle on. Ooh, this looks uh, this looks promising. Okay, so what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna work my way down there. I'm gonna make sure there are no bad guys. I'm gonna collect a few resources, and I'm gonna bring you back once the mine is up and running. Uh, because, uh, again, I, I want to do something a little different this time. Before, we've always uh, followed along. Look, there's Grandma. Hi. Hello. Hello. Uh, we followed along, and, and you've seen me do everything. And, and frankly, that stuff's really boring. I, I mean, you know, come on. Who wants to see me mine? Uh, or, or go collect the initial resources that you need. So I'm going to go gather all that up, and I'll meet you back here in just a minute. Okay, I know I said I'd meet you right over there, but I wandered off a little bit and I found a whole valley full of horses and animals and all kinds of fun stuff. So I've decided to uh, start my initial hobbit hole right here. And I wanted you to understand that uh, that, was, that was the move I was making. So I'm going to start right here and I'll meet you back here. Let's see. Let's just head in here. You know what I don't have? I don't have any coal. That's going to make things tough. Hmm. And it's too late. Okay, I'll be back. Okay, it's been uh, a couple of seconds for you. It's been like an hour and a half for me. So real quick, I uh, wanted to bring you up to date. Uh, over there are the horses that I told you about. I've got some sheep on the other side of that hill. I've got some uh, pigs over on the other side of that hill. I found some sugar cane. I've brought it over and planted it. I have made a bucket. I have started some wheat growing. And then this is what I've done inside. Uh, again, this is early days yet. Got a furnace, couple of chests. Did manage to shear some sheep and find a bed. Now, I've got a little... I'm going to call it a failed experiment, although I'm not yet ready to give up because I've grown trees underground before. And I believe that it has enough room. And I believe it has enough light. So we'll see. <laughs> we'll see what happens there. Uh, I did 
pop out right into this little cavern, which is exposed to the sky over there. I may move the tree farm. Uh, and then I've, I've dug down uh, all the way. Let's see, I think I'm at um, uh, like 16 maybe. I, I came upstairs to get, so, uh, to get some more stairs. Now, I had a little challenge in here. Oh, yeah, see? There's that little challenge. Right there he is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, <laughs> I had a little challenge there. I've had a little challenge here. Uh, oh, it's, it's currently empty, I think maybe because I left. Uh, but the skeletons really love it over there. So, they've been ganging up on me. Uh, let's see what I found. Uh, that goes up and around, doesn't really go anywhere. This goes down and around, doesn't really go anywhere. And let's see where I'm at right here. I'm at 10. So this is normally where I would um, start leveling things out. Uh, maybe go down just a couple of more. Let's see, how many stairs do I have? I went upstairs and got 37 more. Because, uh, you know, you never know. Uh, so anyway, I'm just about to break out into the area where I'm going to start mining. And since this, since I'm not bringing you through every little step of the way, I thought I'd just pop in from time to time and show you that uh, I am making progress and that I'm doing this legit. Uh, let's see, where are we? Tell me, tell me, tell me. We're at five. Okay. So typically, this is where I would start and go back up. Uh, I'd come back up to six and then go sideways. So let's do this. And I'm on, uh, I am on five. So I'm going to go back up one. Okay, and this is going to be where the main level of my mine is. So I'm going to go start knocking some of this down, bring you back in just a bit. Okay, <laughs> yippee! So guess what I found? I found a diamond. I thought I'd bring you back in for that little look-see. Uh, I've had a bit of challenge. I apparently have chosen to dig down right where there's just a metric butt-ton of lava everywhere. Lava everywhere, every... I mean, I, I can't move for hitting lava. Oh, and zombie. Let's see. Okay, just made the advancements. Wanted you to see that. Uh, let's look at all of these. Nice, 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 nice. Okay, yeah, I normally would be a little more um, circumspect in pulling those out, uh, making sure that, you know, I don't have any lava underneath them. Uh, oh, I almost threw those. That would be terrible. So, like I said, I... I've got just a whole bunch of lava all the way around me. I have been messing with it. Just, I, I, I cannot get ahead. Let me see if I can show you where I'm at. So, okay. So, I've got another one right over here. That's lava right behind here. Uh, and I knew that I had some gravel over here, so I just went up to, uh, come on, really? Let me in. Just went up to harvest some of this gravel that, that I knew I had over here and found the diamonds. Anyway, just wanted to bring you in and show you that. Um, I don't know about you, but diamonds, I'm sorry, <laughs> diamonds are a girl's best friend. So is gravel. Gravel makes getting through uh, lava a lot easier. And if I fill this up, then I can retrieve the, the gravel uh, and use it on the next pool. But I have a giant, in fact, let me show you this. I have a giant pool over here. I'm not, I'm just going to have to go around. Uh, you know, when the slits cut through it, I'm just going to have to go around it. So, look, there it is. I'll show you what it looks like in here. Oh, hello. Really? My, par my parkour skills are lightweight. Okay. So, do you see what I'm saying? It, it, uh, it goes all the way around. See what I'm saying? Just just a long lava lake here. Uh, so I've been I've been dealing with a bunch of lava. Anyway, that's that's why I haven't made much uh, much progress. But I did want to bring you in and show you diamonds, baby! Woohoo! 
Okay, more soon. <laughs> okay, so let me tell you what I got going on. So I caught a chicken, brought him home, went and got another one, brought him home, bred him, got a couple of chickens. I have a experiment going here, and do you know what? It worked. Um, I have trees. So I'm getting ready to make a hopper and make an automated chicken cooker. Uh, these are my starter chickens. I will get them in there. Uh, so this is typically the kind of thing that I would do in my previous Let's Play, you know, an automated cook, uh, chicken cooker. Um, seems pretty straightforward, but uh, you know what, I, I think what I'm going to do is I'll wait and I'll let you tell me, is that something you want to see or not? Uh, leave that in the comments down below and if you want to see it, I will, I'll record it. Uh, if, if I don't get a comment on it, I'm just going to move on. Okay, hang on, uh, I'll be back soon. Still mining. Okay. <laughs> I think I'm going to wrap it for the night. I've been playing for several hours and I'm I haven't made as much progress as I want. So let me let me let me explain you. I went over there, I found some wheat. I brought over a couple of cows. I've been breeding them. I've got a what is it? Two babies right now. Okay, that's good news. Um it's still the same episode, so nobody has said anything in the comments. So what I did in the meantime was I put a hopper and a chest in here so that I could capture the eggs. Okay, I'm going to need a bunch of eggs to start the automated chicken cooker. Um, let's see, I've harvested the wood. Let's see, what else have I done? Um, I found a village. Yes. Um, so right over here, okay, on the other side of that hill, on the other side of one more hill, there is a village complete with iron golem and and all kinds of really cool villagers uh, that I'll be able to trade with. In fact, I made a note of um, of what we have over there, and I need uh, I think it's uh, t ten paper to get an emerald, and for six emeralds he'll give me. Oh, I've forgotten. Oh, anyway, um, so the bottom line is I need some paper, which I can produce. I, you know, I've got some, uh, I've got some sugar cane coming. I've just gone upstairs to get, there you go. Now I have an infinite water supply. So if I pull from the center one, it should refill. And it does. Woohoo! Okay, that means I can close this off. You know what, let's just do that. I don't want to fall in. Uh, can I do that? Actually, no, that's going to stop me from getting the other one. Anyway, um, I have made a big mess down here <laughs> with some, with some uh, uh, lava. I have discovered three or four caverns. Uh-oh, that does not sound good. Uh, is this... Where are they? Probably, are they around on the other side of that? I don't know. Uh-oh, that did not sound good. <gasps> and I, I stuck myself in here. Yay. Uh, where? Is it? Oh, that's not good. <laughs> so they're not over... Oh, maybe. They're trying to get to me. Do you hear them? Let's see, let's take this off so I can jump. No, it's not over there unless... Oh, I don't know. I know that's lava. Hmm. I don't know. So, do you see what I'm saying? I've got a hot mess down here I'm trying to clean up. I haven't even cut one slit all the way through. Uh, I keep getting sidetracked. Um, lots of little fun projects. <gasps> Not cool, not cool. See, there's that there's that thing again. Okay, so I've got quite a bit of smelting going on. I've got quite a bit of lava that I'm dealing with. And I am, 
you know, I've been sitting in the desk now for several hours. I, I think I'm just going to go ahead and call it and hope that uh, this short episode was enough. Uh, if you enjoyed it, please smash that like button. Otherwise, you know, uh, there's all kinds of great YouTubers out there. Find somebody who works for you. Uh, this is Minecraft Gran, the geeky Minecrafter. That's right, a Minecraft playing granny. Signing off. Hoping that you'll join me for the next episode where, oh, God willing, and the creek don't rise, less lava, more mining, and we can start our big projects. So, till the next time, happy mining! <laughs> <laughs>